run pattern is certainly positive PEO, but that's the invitation to the very ordinary circumstances of life. And I just, deep within, I responded uh, to that call. Uh, mm -hmm. But it's his initiative, and uh, very rarely does he, does he just show up in a very majestic way, and I mean, I mean, that may happen maybe with certain people here and there, but by and large, it's always incremental. He comes knocking very slowly and reveals his presence, and then step by step, and um, so it's his initiative, our response. Amen. And you know, I find amazing with Padre Pio, um, in my reversion, quote unquote, I don't even think it was a reversion, because even though it was cradle Catholic, I was never in the faith, you know? So when, when that time came where the Lord gave me a big healing, in two ways, depression mm, and mm. Uh, spiritual healing where I got my faith back. I, and um, I was in depression for seven years. What I noticed when I started reading the books of Padre Pio was his gift was so profuse because he gave all of himself. Yeah. It was like an exchange. Yeah. I give you my whole that's entire a, life. It's a great line. Isn't that beautiful? Yeah, that's it. And people don't realize that's where your great hope is. That's where your great joy is. They think that the more I keep of myself, I'll be happier, but when you give more to God, He gives more back, and the joy that resounds. That's beautiful. Isn't it beautiful? That's well, well put. And I think that applies to marriages. Yes, like, yeah. Uh, like if people, if a couple holds back from one another, they, do, they don't grow into the depths. But the more they, like uh, self-donation, yes. if, it, if it's reciprocal, but friendships, uh, any type of relationships. And of course it's the Lord too, because his gifts are he's eternal, his eternal love and yes. uh, the exchange. But you're right, that's that's the key. And the beauty is that that's going to be my homily tonight. It's, it can happen right now. You're going to hear his homily now, okay? <laughs> it can happen, like that exchange, that yes. invitation is like right at the moment. You know, you don't have to. And like, it's like any walk of life. Like I was um, the, the 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 Italian um, young man who Rocco is his name. No, not Rocco. Uh, oh my gosh. Gian, I forget his name, but he he's 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 a blessed now, and his parents weren't even religious, and he felt the call and he grew with it, and it doesn't mean that you could you're you're planted in a home that's so religious, when you're called you're called and it's your response I think, exactly. you know. Yes. But the grace is always there, it's always like there. the sun. It's, even when it's cloudy, the sun is there. Yes, yes. And all we have to do is just give our yes. Yes. Yeah. In whatever circumstance or moment of the day, uh, and I love what you said. I hope you know the, the depression. Uh, mm -hmm. That was a uh, instantaneous. Yeah, that's... Seven years. And then you were healed. I was healed instant. You know why? Because I was so far away from the faith, and I was a mortal sin. I the grace of God was still there in terms of I had a I had a couple of dreams where I saw myself walking up steps into a church and going into confession, and like an idiot, I'm like. What does that mean? <laughs> I didn't respond to it. I didn't go deep into it. But then after seven years, I didn't know where else I was going to go because I knew that I would need medication soon. And um, the Blessed Mother appeared That's to beautiful. me. That's beautiful. And she's, she looked into my heart and she said, have no fear. And it blasted out of me. The moment she put up her hand, she said, have no fear. I, I had joy that was, that was starting to bud. And it was explosive. And, and then after that, of course, um, because I had people who, was who were close to me that were not Catholic, I said to the Lord, Lord, I really want to know the truth. Which is your church? Which is the true church? And I had a project, Protestant Bible, and it brought me to the Catholic faith. Because I sought the truth. And I think anyone who seeks the truth will get the truth. Beautiful. So that's why I'm so blessed. Yeah, oh, thank you. Yeah, that's a great witness. So um, Father's going to be giving confession now. Yeah, so we have to yeah. say goodbye. Okay,